We'll guide you through how to fix Roblox not installing on your PC. If you find this guide useful, then please consider subscribing and liking the video. So firstly, go to the installer and what you want to do is try installing it as an administrator. So what you want to do is right click on it. I've personally got it on my desktop, but you may have it in your downloads folder. It doesn't matter, right click on it and then tap on run as administrator. You'll go and get the Windows security pop-up, which you'll need to agree to, and then go and see if it will install. If it still doesn't install, then your Windows Defender or firewall may be blocking it. So what you want to do is try disabling these temporarily to see if you can get around it. So open up your Windows start menu by pressing on the start button and then go and open settings. If you can't see it, just search for settings and then head over to the left and you need to go and press on privacy and security. Then click on Windows security, just like so, and press on open Windows security. And if you go into virus and threat protection in here, there should be a switch. Personally, I don't have this switch because I don't use Windows Defender. But if you've got the switch for Windows Defender, go and do it or open up your third party antivirus like I will. Once you've made those changes, then try installing Roblox and go and see if it works. Then you can come back here and go and turn them back on as they're definitely good to have on. For the next fix, I recommend re-downloading the Roblox installer. So to do that, you go and open up a web browser and go to Roblox just like this. And then I'll go and try and play this game here. I'll click on play and I'll just press cancel. And if you just wait for this to sort of keep loading, eventually it's gonna go and say download and install Roblox. Click there like this and it's now downloaded. So I can go and locate the installer in my downloads folder in my file explorer. I can then try running this new installer and this works well because the old installer may be corrupt or there may be another error wrong with it. So it's definitely worth trying a new installer. For the next method, you need to click on the search at the bottom of your computer and type in run just like this and open it up. And you then need to type in percentage app data percentage just like so and click OK. Your file explorer will then open and you need to go to the top here and you need to click on app data. And then once you've clicked on app data, go into local and scroll down until you find Roblox. Here it is and double click on it. And then you need to go into versions and then go and get to the most recent version. For example, we can see the dates here. Um, so this is the 30th of October, so I click here. And then once you're inside the folder, go and look for the Roblox player launcher or installer. If you don't have it in this folder, then just go back and go to the next most recent one. And then if it isn't in this one here, you can then do a different version and then hopefully you should find it. So mine's in here. Then what you can do is try running the player launcher or installer from this folder. I've just heard some people say that fixed their problem, so it's worth trying. If that still didn't work for you, then there may be a problem with Roblox servers themselves. So what I recommend you do is open up a web browser that can be any and go to any search engine and just go and search for Roblox status or Roblox server status. And I recommend checking out the official Roblox page, which is status.roblox.com. And at the top here, you're gonna go and see if there are any problems. As you can see, it says all systems operational, which is great. Um, and if you scroll down, you're gonna see past problems, which we don't need to see really, because if there's a problem here, then that's why it isn't working. And if we go back um, to this page here, you can also use other down detectors. If there is an outage, you're gonna see a huge spike with like hundreds, if not thousands, you know, 30 in an hour isn't that exceptionally high. And you can actually see the baseline here um, that down detector has. And if there is a problem with Roblox servers, then all you can do is wait until the problem is resolved. 